Oh, I'm gonna roll it down, and if I don't hit, I'm gonna forfeit and save time. There's really no point in playing the rest of this out. We all know exactly how it's going to end. I am not going to be able to qualify for the turn anymore. There was literally nothing that could have been done that game. He basically made. Oh, uh, over it's, it's uh. Wanted me to go for a two four a.m. here. Sorry, what? It's 4 a.m. here. Yes, I understand. I know I've taken up a lot of your time. I wish you the best, best of luck, sir. I appreciate you hanging out with me. I will attempt to salvage my LP and still qualify for the tournament. Good luck, my friend. Yes, thanks for joining me. Box, box, the call was fine. It clearly wasn't. It took a, a, an unlosable top four to like a, a first rate gamble where we were contested. So then we went eighth. Like, do you understand what that gamble did? Like, it's it's cool going for the three star. I throw games all the time for content, but like, I'm trying to qualify for a tournament. All I had, to, and I'm one, I was one game away. Like, he told me to basically go for a contested Nyla three, instead of just like going eight and then winning the game as I normally would have with my free gen three. And again, like, I'm not angry at him. He's, he's helped me a lot. He made a lot of right calls over the course of our time together. I would never be mad at him for that. I'm just frustrated at my situation because now I am either, I, I have to stay up for like four hours. I've been up for like 36 hours now and I'm not going to qualify for the tournament unless I play out of my mind. My brain's sitting at 20% speed and I'm fucked. I have to go figure something out and get my LP back. I, I need to climb 100 LP on zero hours of sleep or else I'm dead. Like, I really want to play in these tournaments, and I had it locked in. If I throw it now, I'm never going to be able to sleep. I'm going to play the ad break. I'll see you guys later. I need to play rogues here. At least that's what it looks like is my best angle. VN Remix. I did not want to win that. I just fucked myself for winning that. I played Three units, and I ended up winning. Hello, Albert. Oh, hello. Is everything good? Are you? What are you planning to play this game? I think I'm playing Graves Rule, but I've mentally given up. Wait, why? You're, you're pretty close to the cutoff, right? Uh, like, if I get two first places, yes, I'm back. But oh. I have no confidence in my ability to think right now. I'm thinking at 20% speed, maybe. It's the same okay, as like at the end of my 30-hour stream. Oh, don't worry, I got you. What's the Ishtal this game? 
win. It's not very good, but oh. I was offered silver ticket and I had three graves. So I figured I would go graves reroll here, but I don't think, I mean, it's not looking good. I was like, I'm torn between trying to go for like echo on cat versus mm -hmm. uh, just going for graves three. I'm pretty sure I have to go for graves three here. I, I think you generally always have to go for graves three. Graves three and then use that to stabilize, yeah. Yeah. But I'm, I looked at the build and the rambling guide uh -huh. doesn't look correct. The rambling guide says four rogues. Uh huh. And then, um, wait, let me make sure I lose this round. It's just Jinx. Oh, right? this guy's like inting his whole board. Pray you don't fight him. Yeah. Okay, okay. that's good. So it's four, the rambling guide says four rogues, Alawi, and MF for Bilgewater. Maybe there's like an outdated oh, guide. Okay, no, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think that's how you play. I've never so seen I'm that. I'm pretty sure it's like Nico. Uh, well, if it's wind, where's the hex? Uh, I don't know. know yet. Okay. Um, so you just reroll four rogues, and then you reroll Jinx, and that's basically what you do. Jinx? Okay. And then, yeah, because for Gunner, and then... That makes sense. Uh, I think... I, I, I don't this? even know if this... I don't I know. Need to roll for, like, a two-star. I might want to play just, like, two Bastion. It should be okay, I think. This comp is really strong though, like Graves 3's um, average is like a 3 point something. I think I need to hyper roll it. I am uncontested. Yeah, you have 5, right? You should hit. Oh, Kiana. Nice. Oh, money. Nice. And for Graves, generally, you want like BT Titan Sterix. Is yeah, the three so I grabbed the sword for okay. that. So what units was it? It was like, it was just Jinx? It's just right. Jinx and four rogues, yeah. Okay. And... You can keep the Ishtal if you want to play it for now. I am here to take uh, I haven't hit a single unit in the build. Uh... Okay. Okay, looking good. I I'm pretty sure I keep going. Yeah, I think you just roll it down, right? To zero, yeah. Uh, I would just roll to... Okay, now now I would... Now, just... now we're going to yeah, zero. Yeah, yeah, now you just keep going, yeah. Yeah, I think you buy that. Oh my god. One Graves, please. Nice. Okay. I mean, that, that's gotta Your be worth items? it, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I think so. I mean, you also almost have Jinx 3. I think Jinx 3 is like actually really good as well in the comp. Um... End of the line. And I feel like you're pretty Double trouble. Now. Oh my god, you won the game. Yeah. That It works retroactively, right? Like, yeah, it does. Okay. I saw a lot of oh my god, I don't know if your stream is really lagging or or like your so screen share or it's me. So I'll be right back. Yeah, I'll, I'll restart it. So I don't have any of the items for graves. I don't have titans or BT or, or Starks. Yeah, so I think you should Am I settling for like IE here? Uh, I think it's probably Hodge here. I would make a Hodge and then you can go for like BT Starks or Titan Starks depending on the carousel. Let okay, me then. let me look it up. I don't actually play this comp too much. So let me just look up graves items. Yeah, Hodge is pretty good. Um, I think Titan, Titan, Sterix. I think like overall, I really like Sterix on Rogue. So like maybe you go for a Sterix next. Oh fuck, I should have, I had a stronger board available. Hopefully I still win. It's okay if you lose, cause you keep your streak. That is true. Oh yeah, what about Night Harvester? Um, yeah, Night Harvester is pretty good too. I'll just make it because you have like no items and then just go for Sterics. I would just go for Sterix, Yeah Okay, there. Yeah, that's my strongest. Board. Yeah, that's the strongest board. Yeah Sterix is re are really good Yeah, I'm down and then we get Sterix on Carousel. Okay, I mean double trouble rogues definitely seems like one of those like recipes for like an instant win Yeah, I would also put like t the rogues not all on the same side like that. 
Yeah. And you should be like super stable now, I think. Yeah, I'd imagine so with this. Oh, I've never played Graves, but I know that like when I see people with Graves 3, I'm just like, oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, it's it's super strong. Um, I'm pretty sure that I can see. Double Trouble Graves 3 is a, actually a 3.0 average. Sterix. Yeah. So why do you say you like Sterix here? Is there like a specific reason that it's good on rogues? Um, every time I play rogues, which is okay, not often. I actually don't play rogues that often, but like it saves you so hard, like in a lot of fights. And compared to like a BT just, or Titans. Um, well, I don't know if BT you need BT because you have Hodge. Like otherwise, I would like a BT because you have a Hodge, right? Yeah. Like surely you don't need. So you wouldn't slam an IE for like assassin potential. No, I don't think you slam IE most of the times in um rogues. Like you don't really need it. I'm pretty sure. Okay. I swear. Uh, I don't think I need to level. I want to say this. No, I think you save while. HP. Um, but people do look really strong. Like two people have Azir's already. I mean, Azir's garbage. That unit sucks. Oh, well, it's it's strong stage three, I think. But yeah, I do agree. I do not think Azir, this Azir unit is very good. I have stopped playing him. So we're going to go six, probably seven. And then we're going to roll for four rogues. And then Jinx uh, three. Yeah. I think you just roll on seven, because otherwise you can't fit your board, right? Yeah, that makes sense. I, this hopefully stabilizes us to seven. Double graves, double jinx. Man, I really, also, huh? I really don't like the design of double trouble. Sorry, what'd you say? Oh yeah, no, I'm. I think you do have to play four rogues ASAP. Is uh, what yeah, I, I agree. Say. Oh nice, it's better than. Am I still actually pretty good on Echo, I think? Oh, this guy's doing the anti-rogue positioning. Is there a way you can beat someone who's doing the anti-rogue positioning? Uh, yeah, I, I don't think they have enough units. Anyone has enough units right now to do the anti-rogue positioning. I mean, it only takes three. Because you, like, after either side kills the middle, like, you would just quickly kill off the rest of the front line and go to the carry, right? I don't know, I feel like when I do the anti-rogue positioning, unless you have a super, super beefy front line, and a super, super good backline, like the rogues just get on you, so, your carry so fast anyway. Even if mm. like, it, like your carry will just be the last one alive, like true, but then there's four rogues on your carry, like you're you're still gonna lose. Like you'd have to, you just have to have a really high roll board no matter what to um, even be able to do the anti rogue positioning. Okay. Also, silver ticket is so good. Uh, I think I'm high rolling it. 30% chance is not as much as you'd think. Hmm. That's like once in a while you'll get a free roll, and once in a once in a while you'll get a free roll that gives you a free roll. But golden tickets literally like sometimes you get like ten rolls in a row. Yeah. I mean, I, I think it's good for it's like about the right power level for the, this augment tier. Ooh, crown guard echo maybe. I think it's level. Yeah. And then I think I sit the next round. I level up and then just spike to my board, get to my level seven board, and mm -hmm. then sit. Yeah, I'm down. I'm also. I'm wondering if people like roll for Kiana three here. Like probably not, right? You don't even have Kiana items. You could roll for it because I'm at six jinxes. But... Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Because you have five and six. I right, roll once for a cat. I didn't hit. Okay. Hopefully, I win. If I win this, it's it's a big deal. I think I do, as long as Graves goes to the back line. I think you do, because your Graves should get on the on pause, right? Yeah. Oh my god. That was close. I barely won this. Oh my, my god, your Graves is still yeah, alive. Holy <laughs> shit, he's a beast. Alright, nope. let's level to seven, roll for one cat, and then probably chill there. I feel like I need yeah. to slam something. It might be a crown guard echo. Um, no, I think, if anything, isn't it? Ionic on a pharmacist. Oh, um, I like Chris Crown with double trouble. I feel like it's kind of sick. Yeah, but... I know, but scary, right? Uh, I feel like I'm actually down. It would make like an unlosable board. Really? I, I'm also down for a pharmacist. pharmacist real quick. It's pharmacist three, right? Yeah. Oh, pharmacist three is, I think, yeah, it, healing it generally sense. is pretty good. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm too scared to take Chris Crown. Okay. Yeah, just level for a cat. Oh, Echo. Jinx. 
cat. It's over Echo. Oh, oh yeah, it's over Jinx. Yeah, that's right. Wait, so you think it's a Spark Echo? Um, I think it's probably a Spark Echo, yeah. I'm done. Fuck, since I got so close, I I think I was supposed to roll for it. Oh, you have a thing on your... Oh, no. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, nice. Oh, so close. Um... You have a oh, remover, I'm, I'm right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm down to roll. You're one off. Jinx? Stands for Jinx! And then... Um, I think you play two Kianas yeah. over an Echo. Or you want to play two Jinxes? Is Jinx... She's Jinx kind three. of naked. Okay. I mean, it's actually like some pretty real... She's got... It's two Jinx 3s with Gunner, right? Like... Uh-huh. I think roll a little bit more. Like, roll to 10 for Cat 2. Kiana. Yeah. Just roll. Oh, well, now I'm just rolling for Kiana 3. Mm-hmm. I think Titan's Kiana is pretty good. So you can go for a bow on Carousel. I'm down. We just leave Jinx naked, I guess. Yeah. Hang on, I gotta send a, go a message. I'm going to go apologize to Toast. I was very angry. Wait, what happened? Alright, he, he was just helping me climb. And when oh. I was one game away, he made a call that I really disagreed with, but we went for it, and then we went eighth. And oh, I was no. really angry, but I feel bad. Oh, the man no. stayed, up, stayed up with me. He made many good calls. Well, did you yell at him? Uh, I didn't yell at him. I basically said, like, oh my god, I'm fucked. It's more depression than it is rage at him, but I should still apologize. It was pretty bad. That's okay. At least you're apologizing. I'm sure Toast understands. Bow? Yeah, I'm looking at the bow. Um, If not sword, I think sword. We can set, set up her Kiana. All right, I'm, I'm gonna roll. I'm, I'm very Yeah, close. I'm down to roll. You're like... All right. You may now appreciate me. GG. I'll uh, put that over Jinx. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if you're ever playing the Jinx, by the way. This double trouble Jinx. That's true, because you're just going to be double troubling the rogues. Yeah. Now. Oh, fuck. If we didn't make this... I mean, there's no way we could have known we were going to hit so fast. But I was thinking, like, oh, I, there was probably an opportunity to make uh, BT. That's fine, though. That should be uh, fine. Well, yeah, I mean, who knew? It's, it's okay. It's also like, I think Spark is really good in this comp because like Cat and Echo, it helps them hold them so much. So. Why does it say you have an 85% chance when I'm not 100% sure how we're pulling this? Wait, Bruiser oh. Kaisa with two Gwinsus. That is woke and really bad. Wait, actually, we are killing it. What do you say? Oh, I thought we weren't killing this Cho'Gath, but it doesn't look that bad. Like, it wasn't really the rest cool. of this team is terrible. Yeah. But yeah, I really don't like the design of Double Trouble. It's it's really degenerate. It's just really degenerate right now because I think they haven't balanced like any of the reroll comps properly. I think well, once it was like this mm -hmm. in previous sets as well. Like I remember like uh, oh, set seven, yeah. like literally a Double Trouble comp was like two siphons, two shield use. Oh, okay. Like, I, <laughs> you're just like barely looking for any. You're not interacting with uh -huh. a, a very large majority of like the units in the game. And I think it's like kind of bad. Yeah. I, I think it's crazy that, that we're literally like looking for four rogues plus one unit. And then every single level, what are we going to play? Just another copy of a rogue. Oh, it's nice to have yeah. a random Jinx 3, though, as a backline. I'm really glad you told me about the Jinx version, because otherwise I would have just followed this Ramblin' guide that I think is outdated, and I would have been like, why mm -hmm. am I building Misfortune? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, I think you always play Jinx, because, like, it actually makes a lot of sense. It makes a lot of sense, yeah. Roll, yeah. It's backline, it's Zahn, and Gunner. And at least it's, it's a good thing that it's, like, Thresh, so that you can actually get items for all your rogues. Wait, sorry, what'd you say? Oh, I said I'm glad it's Thresh's sync up. Oh, yeah. Uh, I... Okay, maybe I can chill. 
probably fine. Yeah, All right, open that. So we got these items. Titan? Okay, Titans. I'm pretty sure it's Titan. Titan's BT. Yeah. Holy shit, isn't Titans. that crazy? Just get BIS for fun. And then eventually we'll get another component and we'll figure it out. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, and I mean, don't we just... I just put one rogue on each side and like they're kind of fucked? Yeah. That's what they people do. Cause... <laughs> yeah, because this is overwhelming. My entire team is rogues. Okay, my That's counter. Strong, my he counter has, needs to um... get on this Kira. Oh no. I think he. Oh, oh no. Wow. Fiora just. Oh, I hate Fiora so much. I outplayed like, just... the shit out of my team. Alright, well, now I'm rolling. I think he just rolled Okay, good roll down. Yeah. Someone's day's about to get wrecked. Uh, I guess I'm going I, I, It doesn't go. I think you just have to go eight, yeah. Yeah. Good roll down. Hello, Revengeance. I mean, it's pretty much guaranteed top four. I feel like there's still a pretty high chance of going first here. I think you can definitely go first with uh, your augments, your items, and your units. Like, you're just missing some items. But as the game goes on, like, you're going to get them. So, like, the longer the game goes, the higher the chance you win. Yeah, I mean, that's if I maintain my econ. I kind of want to send it to 8 to just to play this echo and then sit. Then try again later for cat 3. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm down. I think it's a huge spike. God. The backline access traits are always so like... I wouldn't say they're bad design. I understand like why they have to exist in a game like TFT. But like, mm -hmm. every time you face Whatever the backline trade is, whether it's hacker or assassin or rogue, it's just like, oh great, I lose 20 HP again. Well, okay, I actually think. Oh, do you want to level here, by the way? Because right now, uh, the other people look really strong. Like, it, I mean, it's up to you. Like, if you want to, because oh, yeah, I don't really I, think I it matters. Like, I don't even think you're rolling for cat three, by the way. Okay, I mean, yeah, if we're not rolling for cat three, then there's nothing to do. So I'm uh -huh. done. Maybe this is just like a, a echo double trouble death. So, okay, what I was going to say was, I think hackers and rogues are actually infinitely worse than, um... Assassins. Assassins. Yeah. Like, there's no counter! Like, what are you supposed to do? Oh, oh my god! god. Oh, oh wait, my god! No, we, we okay. just got it. Oh, okay. We didn't have it. I, I would have noticed it. Um, Sterix? Another? St oh my god, and it's on a Heimer. Except I don't think you can fit in Heimer. No. Okay, um, I'm down for GS, DB. Yeah. Oh, for Kiana, yeah. Maybe DB's better for Kiana. Yeah, I, I was actually thinking I'm gonna GS this Echo. Oh, okay. Um, well, who did, can you see who did the most damage last fight? Fiora. Oh, Sorry, you meant on our team. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, Echo, Echo 3 is our method of dealing with Fuhrer. That's why I was Yeah, like... sure. Let's GS. And we could actually slam a Shoujin. We got two removers. I'm down for Shoujin. Oh, I was going to say Jinx maybe, but like, yeah, I can see. We got two removers. I might as well just do this for Yeah, a I love two removers. Let's just do it. Okay, we keep getting owned by Fuhrers that go infinite. We need um like a Heimer or something, I think, for Shred and Anti Heal, and then I think we can actually beat Fiora. Like he did I a rogue position there, right? But like, it does not matter. Fine. Doesn't have to be Heimer. That's true. If we can just somehow get Anti Heal. Hey, top four. Oh God! Wait. They're all 50 gold. Oh fuck, both these guys are going nine. They're all so strong. I mean, there's no dodging my rogues. I'm literally the entire front line. Oh, he did the anti-rogue positioning. Yeah. Oh, wait. I think it wait. might actually work. Because yeah, it actually works because so I can't get through this Shogath. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. 
We got through it. I don't know how, but we did it. Wait. Oh, wait. I think I win. win. Barely. GS diff? Yeah, actually, a GS diff. Oh, shit. That was nice. so close. Okay, well, it's at least a third. Uh, I wonder. You I feel like I beat guy. him. I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure you beat him. If we get anti heal here, hmm. you think I just send it for Heimer? No, I think you go nine. I could Wait, try like, to. It takes three fights. Like, there's no one to take out, right? Like, well, are you planning to take out? Yeah, I guess you'd have to take out a double, like a high value double yeah. trouble. Yeah. Okay, I'm done at attempt nine. It seems hard, but we can try. Unknown. Or I just get anti heal right here. Boom. Dang. Uh, it might actually be another GS. Uh, yeah, I'm Is not with GS or Gunblade. I don't think Nash Nashers who. All right, so it's two GSs. Wait, uh, can you look at the chicken nuggy guy? What is he yeah. playing? I'm gonna do a GS. I want my Echo to one shot. Sure. I don't. Yeah, I don't think you need Gunblade because you have harm assist. Have, yeah, harm assist. Okay, honestly, this Echo might be like a raid boss that one shots. Like this might be my answer to Fiora. I wouldn't be surprised if the Psycho could actually do it. Oh! It, work? it worked! It worked! It worked! We did it! We, 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 oh, I, stop, stop, stop. Yeah, 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 I? we, we. Okay. We All right, guys, I had, I mean, I just watched from now on. All good. Echo did it. Boy, that is so huge. This double giant slayer echoed through with double trouble actually just one shot the Fiora, preventing any counterplay. I'm down. All right, next we get a Heimer and GG. Yeah, sack two, go nine. Play Heimer for flame, shrink, shrink. Oh, I guess strong. Well, hopefully Keanu can at least perma stun. Can Keanu perma stun? Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, she can. This Amira can do anything. My God, is it a force? Wow, he died. Dude, rogues are so like not fair. <laughs> I don't feel like I express any skill. The only like knowledge check or the skill was like remembering to put in a jinx, which I appreciate you telling me about because otherwise I would have had the wrong build comp. But then like I hit double trouble. I was like, oh, well, I just win. Oh God. That's it. too. Yeah. Uh, how can I get my echo to be most likely to hit this Fiora? Well, first I'm going to swap because I... I'm pretty sure he's swapping as well. He didn't swap. He didn't oh, he has move. LDP, so it's actually hard for him to swap. Yeah. Okay, then just kill everyone else and then let Echo one-shot Fiora at the end. I'm down. Okay. Alright, it's just Echo. Echo versus Fiora. Boom! Oh, oh we didn't even God. need wait, the Echo. It's not even close. Yeah. What? Oh, wait. Wait, wait a second. Wait, that's wait, a challenger wait. Aatrox, too. Oh! Okay, oh that's, why, that's why we needed the Echo with two Giant Slayers there. Okay, I'm down for a real third Keon item here. Oh, there um, are none. Um, I don't know. I'm just gonna take this adaptive helm. Okay. Oh, Scotty Lex. Maybe you just level again. Yeah. All right, give me a Heimer. Oh, Mordekaiser. Oh, for Slayer. Yeah. Oh, until you find um, Aatrox the dude. would be really good then. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'm just gonna throw this on even... for now. Okay, sure. He's stuck. Uh, Mord, Mord, wake up! Wake up! Time to play the game! Oh, I got rolled this time. Okay, I wonder what was different. Um, oh, Heimer. Get, yeah, you in? yeah, yeah, yeah. You need right. Shrinko Mechano. Burn Shrink. No, I need a Shrink. I can't. No, I need a Shrink. Okay. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh, and there's Aatrox, but 
Wait, I'd have to I lose double trouble on someone. Yeah, I don't I don't think it's weird. You just put this on Heimer, I think. Like, I could lose double trouble graves. But it feels kinda bad. Oh, here we dead. did it. Nice. We did it! Heimer I don't know why, dip! Like, he oh, yeah, it was, it was definitely the Heimer. Also, if Echo gets an ult on the Fiora, boom. Like, I'm yeah, pretty it's sure just I, over. I'm, I'm pretty sure my Echo was in front of his Fiora that fight. I didn't, I didn't actually see, but probably. I think it died really fast. Wow. Double Trouble is really stupid. <laughs>